having way too much fun with my pink flamingo mask. Yes, I am. Okay, so I'm going to make some colors. And I'm going to use my Knit to Be Fab cardstock that I bought at Hobby Lobby the other day. Because they have flamingos on them. And I'm also going to use some stamps that I got, which I never used yet, which were sitting on my table. And I finally labeled some Dilusions stamps from Diane Reevely. And uh, I don't know what I'm gonna what sentiments I'm gonna use, but I'm gonna use a sentiment from one of one of these one of these, either of people or laugh till you leak. And uh, I'm gonna use one of these on the envelope, and then I'm gonna use this somewhere along the way also. So first things first. I need to decide which color cardstock I'm going to use. Well, which one of these I want. And then maybe use the coordinating color cardstock with it. And I think <laughs> I'm just going to open it up and uh, use this. Because that's what I opened up to. And now I'm going to pause you and I'm going to go look at my card socks and see if I have any pretty colored card socks that will go with this. Okay, I'll be right back. Hi, I'm back. The first thing I've decided to do is from my little piece of colored card stock from the Paper Studios Mint to be Fab collection. I went and I found, where is it, where is it, where is it, oh, I was so organized. Simon Says Stamp, I Love You Dies. Why I have two of them, I don't know. But, I'm gonna put, without even undoing them, I'm gonna put one like this, and one like this. I have the little magnet thing on. And then, the, uh, extra plate to make sure because I have a thinlet and now I'm going to run it through twice forwards and then backwards the U and I oh and I got some some of my tangerine cardstock and envelopes because that was the closest that came that it came to I'm going to have to cut that down. See? See how cool this is? I love you. A bushel and a peck. A bushel. My mom used to sing that to me when I was little. My mom used to have to ride the bus for an hour to go to high school from Montague to Homa. And they used to sing songs back in the 40s. 30s, well, actually the 30s and 40s when she was going to high school. And uh, quite an interesting little story, song she used to teach me. Where's my little pit? Uh, I don't know where they are right now, but that's the work. Okay, got those done. I think I'm done with my big shot for now. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, now I got my 110 pound Nino White Solar White cardstock and my folding thing 
scoring thing, so I'm going to do that. I have it marked right here to know exactly where to make my little folds, where to put my little bone folder to make that. And then you fold it, and you just go, and you got a nice, lovely fold. Nice, lovely fold. God, I haven't made cards in I don't know how long. Move this aside. I've got to cut this down. I'm smashing things all over the place. <sighs> Goodness gracious, my mind is like so lost right now. We're still gotta go six inches, right? And cut it in half. Or yipper. So we put it on the six. Hold it down and go. Nothing right. Um, eight and a half by eleven. 11, so, no, five and a half. So, good thing I checked. It didn't seem right in my mind. I need five and a half. No, that's my bad. And then we got two of equal size. And then half of this. Eight and a half. So four and a quarter. Four and a quarter. Four and a quarter. There you go. Look, it's marked right there for me. How sweet of them. And I'm going to save this piece for later. I might do something more with this piece. I'm not quite sure. But... I do know that when you cut with that thing, it makes that edge raise up a bit. So I like to take my bone folder and just kind of go through and smooth it down. Now, to pull out the big gun, that would be the ATG gun, Advanced Tape Glider. It just works. Work for me, baby. Oh, oh, I just broke it. This is not good. Different. I need a different one. Such is my life. Let's use this, shall we? I'm getting too close to the edge. Whatever. Whatever. And then we line we line them up and we mush them together. Almost. I almost got it lined up. Trim it. I'm gonna with the big scissors. Why? Because I can. 
and I don't like the white showing. The scissors are going crooked either. Ah! I'm such a mess sometimes. But I'm a happy mess, so that's okay. Okay, that's good. Now, uh, let me run glue dots. Let me run glue dots on here. These glue dots are massive, man! Aren't they you? Da, 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 da. Running the little dots, it up. My daughter, I had to order her some new shoes today, and a new ba some new bathing suits. She has, she's now wearing women's size clothes. My child is going to be thirteen. In, in the next month, she's. I'm. I'm not old enough for this. I. I. I am just not. I am not old enough for her to be wearing adult clothes. Her shoe size is bigger than my shoe size. That's just wrong. She takes after my sister in that. My sister has a bigger foot than I have. Ha 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 ha. I'm such a perfectionist, man. Why do I have to be such a perfectionist all the time? See, a lot of people, this, this it just would not bother them, but for me, this bothers me. So let me cut it off quick, get rid of this white. There, no, that makes me happy. Okay, so, it's gonna open, which way do I want it to open? It can be either way, actually. My sentiment that I chose, uh, be you, the world will adjust. things down. Oh, and I can stamp stuff on it. Yeah. That'll work. Let me see. Come on, boo. Come on, blue. Do this. Do this. For all of them. Man. Okay. Let me try this baby one. This will probably work better anyway. Yeah, this one's coming out.
Hold it down with this. Oh, I can put sequins on it. Oh yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. Instead of anything else, any stamping. I'll just leave the stamping for the inside. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. I'm making this stuff up as I go. I love you. tweezers I'm gonna do one you to say I love you in French is je t'aime To say I love you in Haitian Creole, it's moi aime ou. To say I love you in Russian is ya le bleu to bia. To say I love you in Spanish, it's te amo. Sometimes the best is the simplest. Now, I'm going to pause because I need to fix this guy. I'll be right back. Look at this. Look at this, how, how sweet that is. Isn't that sweet? I'll be right back. Okay, so I glued the I Love You on both of them. And I picked out some Avery L pigment ink pads in papaya and ocean mist using my swatches. And I picked out pretty pink posh, four millimeter tangerine and peacock feather sequins. And then I fussy cut the squares out of the paper. And I'm going to attach that, and you will see that in a minute. But in the interim, I'm going to take my Lawn Fawn Plastic Flamingo, my little trademark kind of thing I do with my Happy Mail, Liam Kale Endeavors com, which is my website. I'm going to just stamp the back of each of these little cards. So that they can dry. Hope I'm doing it the right way, because sometimes I don't. Story of my life. And this I just keep in this little container right there. Always. So there. Now this will dry. Yep, you see? Look, I did it right. There you go. My goal is. See if I can do this with as much ease as possible and not getting my fingers <laughs> dirty. Um, I want to get ink on all corners of each little square so that you don't see the white. So, oh, I'm going to use my little tweezers and just dunk it in the pigment.
there you go. And then it'll have a little edge around it. And then I'll let them dry. And then I'll do that with the, the papaya ink also. So I'll be right back. And it, it, it'll be boring just watching me do this, really. Okay, a quick update of what I've done. I used a uh, Ranger Dilutions in between these. Uh, this heart one and my Avery L pigment paint, pigment ink pad in papaya, and papaya, and I stamped the back of my little envelopes to make them extra pretty. I'm letting those dry. I stamped the insides of my cards with using a. Uh, Ranger Dilutions, How Does Your Garden Grow, The Big Bird, and these little flowers, as you can see, in the papaya, and the, it's called Ocean Mist. And my sentiment is, be you, the world will adjust, which goes with the I love you, I think. So that's where my cards stand. Now, I uh, took the ink and I, using a little tweezer took these things and dipped it on the edge so that the edges show color instead of white which makes it prettier and so you don't have to do that but it's prettier if you do and I just kind of recommend it and now I'm gonna put some of these sequins from Pretty Pink Posh onto my little squares with glossy accents it's shiny. It's pretty. So I'm going to put a little dot on here. Oop. Probably could use even less than that. Oop. I'm trying to go... Oh, let me do this. For the middle. Push that down. Like that. That'll be better. Oh, yeah. Yeah. See how I can get just a, the tiniest of little dots on there instead of a big old glob? Oh, turn that one over by mistake. And I'm thinking it's opposite day. And putting, well, I think I'll do this, that one there, and that one. Oh, come on. Don't be silly. I like the green better on the green. So I'm taking the orange off and putting it on an orange. Oh, yes, I am. I'm going, I'm doing it. Yep. I'll attach it later. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You put a green there. Green on green works for me. That's a lot of glossy accents right there, let me tell you. Glossy accents dries clear very fast too. I'm probably going to stick the, the little paper on with glossy accents also onto my cards. And I've, I have just been just relaxing and enjoying listening to music and figuring out slowly what I want to do with these cards and I've just been having a grand old time it, it has actually actually been and I don't I don't want to say the L word literally because I think that word is overused but it really has been months since I've made a card and I really enjoy making cards Life, it just gets in the way sometimes. Do you know 
they did they did biopsies of the four tumors that they had on my thyroid. I had micro cancer in two of the four t tumors. And they're like, ah, don't worry about it. Like, yeah, because you could you took it out, I guess. Oh, dear me. The things we go through in this world. So now I have to get an ultrasound in my neck every six months or so to make sure that nothing's growing in my neck. anymore even though I don't have any thyroid left that was my second thyroid surgery we have a lot of thyroid issues where I live but we're in a coastal community and we eat a lot of seafood I think it has something to do with the iodine that's just my theory I have a lot of theories about a lot of weird things and uh, I could be wrong. I went to the island yesterday, Grand Isle. ISLE, it is an island, it's a barrier island actually, but it's called Grand Isle, to where my sister's camp is, Mingo, short for Flamingo, mm hmm mm hmm yep, it sure is, and uh, took a four hour nap, I looked at her, I got there and I said, I'm tired, I think I need a nap, they woke me up for supper. I went to sleep right after lunch. <sighs> Missed that day. <sighs> MS fatigue, when it hits, I'm down for the count. I have no control over it. If it hits me, I will sleep and I like I said, I have no control. My poor little girl, she wanted to go to the beach. But she don't want to wake me up. She's so sweet. I'll take her to the beach another time. It was kind of cool yesterday. It was in a it's in the low 70s. It's kind of cool for here. Beautiful spring day. Almost finished with this task. I like the little sequins on the squares. Okay, I'm going to stop this and then I'm going to decide what I'm gonna, where I'm going to put them and I'll be right back. Okay, boys and girls, I'm done. I am super happy with the way these turned out. I have gotten out of my rut of not making cards, which has lasted for a very long time. We have glue on the back, but happy mail from liamcalleendeavors.com, which is not my email address, my site name anymore, so I'm going to get another stamp made. They changed it on me. And I just found out from somebody on YouTube who tried the link and it didn't work. How come they changed it? Oh God, anyway, story of my life. That's another story though. So, I got my little guy here. Be you, the world will adjust. Or I'll adjust to the world, one way or another. I love you. I mean it, people. I uh, made it all shimmery, can you tell? 
all shimmery because shimmery is good. And now the way I do this is I match them up and I have these little great envelopes that I put them in if I can because I'm a klutz. Ugh. I'm such a klutz. we go like that and then like so like that and then I put them in my little box with all the other cards that I have made until if somebody wants to buy one or I decide to nail them out so there you go i'm done i hope you liked my video give me a thumbs up if you do you you know click that little thumbs up thing at the bottom at the bottom of the, right right down there not the thumbs down the thumbs up thumbs up and click subscribe and the little bell thing and uh come back and see me sometime and we'll have some more fun yay